You know you want to get yourself a PS. It's, 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 it's neat. Hello, everybody. We're back with more of this. I, I don't know why, but I want to beat Magaman. Magaman? Magaman. That's what they call it. He's a Magoober. He, he's named a Magaman. He's a Magoober driver. Oh, speaking of which, I saw um, two movies, or three movies in the last short while. I saw Annihilation. Where the hell is this going? Oh, you have to. Every time you jump on it. It switches direction. Oh, oh. I got it, I see. This sucks. <laughs> oh, crap. Come on. That's Come back up. Go. Crap. Well, at least it's done now. Yeah. Frickin' A. Come on, where are you taking me? Up. Oh, that was the roof. That was the roof. And up. Here I go. No bees, please. No, no bees. bees. No whammies. That was a leap of faith, and <laughs> I failed the leap of faith. Huh. Hopefully, yeah, it's okay, back. I did come back. But so did the bee. Oh, nice health. <laughs> that freaking bee man. Bee man group. Would you listen? Have you listened to Blue Man Group? Um, I had the opportunity <laughs> to go see him live, and I didn't do it. <laughs> That's fine. Uh, I've been to Vegas six times. And wow. I'm never once caught in the show. That's okay. They're all, it's like they live in Vegas, though. Oh, God. Oh, yeah. They, they told... Oh, oh that's what? Left to the... right. That's left oh, to right. Oh, my God. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Woo! I don't know how I, you... I don't know what happened there, but I lived. But it respawned all the enemies. At least some of the enemies. Okay, back up. Okay. This is, uh... Stressful city, isn't it, Vince? Oh, it back is. up. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, B. Hello, B. I don't like the B. Oh, my God. Okay, we're good. At least you know that if you fall, if you just try to go far left, you're going to land on the beginning platform, at least. Yeah. And, and we, I think we did save state it pretty recently. Did we? So, I think so. Okay. Woo. Huh. Okay, we're good. This is an up and down. And the other one is a, is a left or right. right. Got it. And I got B clipped in the foot. And the screen's still going. Load state. See? Okay, good. Right here. I hate the song, too. It's making me stressed. You hear it? The so it's I, like, I, can't hear the, I can't hear the TV at all. Oh. Okay, I just have it at such a oh, quiet level. Heard a dle, dle, dle. Yeah. Also, me getting smacked by that B caused me to switch directions. Switch inside! Ah. Oh Trade, crap. Trading places. Trading spouses. You remember that dumb show? Um, I actually never watched it. I heard of it, but I never watched it. It was from the producers of Trading Spaces, but instead you you swap your wife out with somebody else's wife. Fuck. Like like Trading Spaces? like. Yeah, so Trading Spaces is like the show where you you get someone else's house, but um, with, yeah, with, on, on TLC or HBO or whatever. But instead, it was trading spouses. So you got someone's uh, someone else's wife for like the weekend. Did you get to do things to the wife? You didn't. You didn't get to nut inside of them. No, isn't that a shame? I'm like I wanted to. Can I trade my wife that doesn't exist? Uh, um. No, uh, I was talking about the uh, Dan Aykroyd. Uh, oh yes, yes. Um, Eddie Murphy. Yes, I know what you're talking about. Oh. Oh god, oh god! Why was I. Oh! Dude, I'm scared. Are you supposed to go left or are you you're supposed, supposed to go right? No, you're supposed to go right because look, it stops. Right there. Okay. So now I get to go back on this fun and journey where everything's flashing. It's huh. such a journey. Like that band from the 80s. You know what? There Seriously. you go. <laughs> Woo, that was hard. When in doubt, save it out. Yes. When in doubt, flubber it out. Did you like the movie Flubber? I did. Oh. Huh. It's not the, it's not the top of my list for Ro uh, Robin Williams movies, but it's pretty high up there. Damn it. I tried not to get flame blasted. What is your favorite you. Robin Williams movie? That is a really good question. I don't know. I was one of the few people who liked Old Dog or was it Old Dogs? That one with John Travolta and Robin Williams. It was towards the end of his career. It was a good movie, but... I only remember like three scenes from it. I, oh my god! Also it deleted my health. Did you see that? It did. What a jerk. How about this? There we go. 
We have sixteen hundred dollars to spend on things once we actually get to that segment. Get to the store. To the store. Oh, what? Oh, I, I know if I can't remember the name of the movie, it probably shouldn't be my favorite. <laughs> but I don't know. I just haven't seen it in a really long time. And I'm trying to remember the name of it. He's like a school teacher. And is it the Gentleman's Club? Fuck. I don't know. Look up his his moveography. The moveography? It's like the discography, but with movies. Can I kill the wall turrets? No. No, I can't. I can kill all these bees, though, in the bee room! In the bee movie! You think that uh, this is where the main boss is going to? Yeah, appear? he's going to spawn right after I kill and all his gonna, bees. You're going to gonna have to fight him and the turrets? Yeah. Because that would be really rude. At least some of the bees are giving me health. He gave me bullets. I don't want bullets. I want health. All I want is health. Bees. As long and as I keep bees. supplying you with health, I mean... That's funny. He dropped a health when he hit me. What about mm. if you go up to that door? Right there. Nope, it's locked. So you literally have to go through this. Yeah. Forever. Or do I, do I, should I climb? No. no. Climbing was a bad idea. What the fuck? Am I supposed to do something? Can I kill the turrets? Am I just stupid? It seems like there's infinite bees. It does seem like there are infinite bees. I'm wondering if you're supposed to do something. Okay, so two of the guns aren't shooting anymore. You can kill them. Yeah. How did I then? Nope. Never mind. One of the guns just turned back on. Yeah. Come on, so health, please. It looks like the one over bottom right. Yeah. Is. Yeah, this gone, one's though. dead. Maybe I have to get the guns to shoot the other guns. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. And killing the bees just gives me extra health. Or bullets. Crap! That's really weird. Uh, who's calling you? Who's calling Mako? Spam! I love spam. Spam's the best. It's Hawaiian ham. <laughs> <laughs> They, they eat it a lot in Hawaii. I know. And in Japan, actually. I don't know, that bullet went right through it. Crap. What the fuck? Oh, God. Wait, am I supposed to be zero? Sort them. Maybe? Do we have to make him kill the door? Huh. Nope. I bet I have to get him to... Because now two of the guns are killed. Yeah. Those two. I bet I have to get a bee to fly into it. You know? You think that's... I think that might be it. Fuck. Let me just get up there. No. I was kind of under it. Yeah, this is dumb. Room that sucks. is so weird. Well, he hit me as good as I hit him. Health. Come on. Yeah, they're, they're still, like, all the gu Two of the guns are still alive. I don't know I don't, how they're blowing up, though. I don't, yeah, I don't know either. I'm trying to... Trying to think. pinpoint it. Fuck. Because it's, it's not... B-related, I don't think. And it's not them shooting each other related. And there's no way you can really hit those ones up top, right? No. Crap. Oh, yep, he's shooting. Come here, B. Do they have to be yellow to hit him, or...? Maybe. No, yellow is when they're charging their guns. See? Yellow is when he's charging. B. Oh. Uh, that was a perfect crisscross. Crap, why'd I dash? Why'd I dash? Dodge. What I dash. This is a dash very... your Robert Parr. Mm -hmm. Everyone, Mrs. Incredible said that. His full name's Dash Heel. Did you know that? I did not know that. I thought it was just Dash. Well, he said it in the first movie because he's, he's like, uh, Dash is complaining that he can't be in track and field. Yeah. 
And then his mom. I love him. at the end when they actually let him be a part of Trapeze. Yep, make it a like, close second! Yeah. <laughs> I love that. That's what I love the. Okay, did you like the second one? Um. Yes, I did like the second one. Crap. But I felt there were, there were missing pieces. Let's try fighting someone else. I think we can get back to that with strats that we know. Yes. Let's spend our money. What yeah, let's see what the money gets us. Okay, the so super recover for uh, for uh, communication and bar extender, extended barrier, um, ultimate Buster shot, speedy shot, Buster plus shoot two, Buster plus one, saber plus, and ultimate saber super slash. Let's buy the saber plus. Let's buy the Buster plus. Let's buy the Buster plus two. Let's buy the get more health when you eat health. By the use less energy when you do your attack. Let's do health extender. Ooh, we can also upgrade his ready to fire. We can't do the ultimate saber. We can literally buy every single upgrade for X that we have available and half of the zero upgrades. Yeah, let's just do that. There's nothing else to spend your money on, so why not? Yeah, there's nothing All right, Let's save really quick. Let's do that. Yeah. Crap. Yes. Yes. Okay, we're good. Alright, we're gonna do this B-Man later. Let's go to Ostrich Person. Oh, you're looking up the, the guide? Yeah, he just... He, he, he slices him himself. Wow. Wow! I guess that is what he's doing. Yeah, whatever, we'll get back to it. I'm getting on my bike. And as soon as you defeat all four, it... Nice. Opens up. Uh, it's an on rail runner. Uh, 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 oh. That sucks. Grr. Well, that was it. My motorcycle. My motorcycle. My motorcycle. It crashed. It went. <laughs> but yeah, I was going to talk about the films I watched. I watched Annihilation. I watched. Did um, you like it? I didn't. It was okay. I liked other things that the director directed. Like, I liked Ex Machina a little bit better. But that's just. Did you like Ex Machina? Uh, I don't think I ever saw that one. Okay, you'll like that more. Uh, I don't know. Natalie Portman, I can't take her seriously. Like, she's really good in some of the stuff she's done. But at the same time, I, like, I can't take her seriously for some reason. I, I like Natalie Portman, and I can take her seriously. But uh, the, my whole problem is, like, a lot of those movies that try to be, like, mindfucks... Yeah. ...are... They don't... They end up leaving you going, no, that's yeah. stupid. Like... And that's exactly how I felt. Like, I was yeah. like, uh, that's, this is... I was expecting something completely different when I saw the, the trailer for that yeah. movie. And then when I went and watched it, I watched it in theaters. Oh, nice. And when I got out of the theater, I was just like, so thankful it was on my movie pass because <laughs> that was not worth it. Not worth my money. But yeah, I saw that. I saw Mission Impossible Fallout. I haven't seen it. Okay, that one was weird, but it was good. I didn't like it as much as Ghost Protocol or Mission Impossible 4, but it was still pretty good. Are right, we in our bike segment? Oh, that's Ooh, what I was supposed to do. I almost got crushied. Yep, I almost got crushied. There you go. You have to keep popping wheelies. Keep popping purse. Oh, God. So, uh, Fallout? Ow! Is okay. that the last one you uh, No, and then I saw The Equalizer 2. Oh, I, would, I really want to see that. It's good. Did you like the first one? I loved the first one. Okay, yeah, you'll like it. It's basically more of the same thing, which isn't a bad thing. And also, Denzel Washington breaks a lot of hands. I, oh my god! It's his favorite thing to do is... Break hands. You lose a hand. You lose a finger. <laughs> no, he does that in the movie a lot. Like, he'll just grab someone's hand, and then he'll be like, Are you left or right-handed, son? Are you left or right-handed? I am right-handed! And then grabs his left hand, and it's like... And he's like... Ah! It's like... That happens like three times. But he's a Lyft driver. Oh my god! But he's a Lyft driver in this movie. So that kind of has something to do with the plot. You know, because he's trying to, like, make ends meet. He was a Home Depot employee in the last yep. one, right? Yeah. But at Home Depot, we went ham. They probably fired him. Well, uh, technically, it wasn't a Home Depot. Like, yeah, it was, it, was their, a, it was their equivalent in that equivalent, universe. Yeah. But, like, the plot is what you'd expect, uh, 
like some of his uh, former agent, oh, some of his former agent buddies have gone rogue. Um, he lives in another house now, but instead, like one of his old like partners when he was in the when he was in the war, uh, got murdered. And God, I told him to jump. Uh, and he's like trying to figure out the whole case, even though the case is closed, kind of thing. Uh-huh. And he finds out some horrible truths. And he befriends like a black kid in the neighborhood who's trying to be gangster. And he's like, "Why would you do that to yourself? Killing's bad." And then he proceeds to kill like a hundred guys. <laughs> it's weird. It's like, come on, Denzel, practice what you preach, man. <laughs> Fuck you! Oh, you have to time that perfectly, man. Denzel, you're killing me, Smalls. One more attempt and we'll end the episode. But Denzel does a really crazy good job in the movie. Like, I I really liked his character in this one as well. Yeah. Uh, a weird part to the plot is that uh, a hurricane is happening in his old town where him and his wife used to live before she was murdered. Mm-hmm. Uh, so a hurricane's happening. So to lure the bad guys, he goes back to his home. Like, as in his home that he shared with his, wife, or his dead wife. So that's where half the back half of the movie takes place during a hurricane. It's weird. So he's using that like to his advantage. It almost sounds like they might be trying to do too much. It was still good though. I still like the plot was still followable. God damn it. And it was still a really good movie. I'd rather watch the first one if it was like you have two hours, Nate, watch a watch one of the two equalizer movies. I'd watch the first one, but the second one was very entertaining. Okay. That's my Nate reviews. Nate but fuck. Nate reviews films even though you didn't want him to. Do 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 do. That's the new show I'm working on, Vince. I have been thinking about doing a review for my channel. Oh, nice. Uh, fucking. Oh, I swear you have to be zero here. I think he jumps better. Slice. Slice. Kimbo Slice. Who's your least favorite uh, action movie star? Action movie star. Least favorite. Like if he's in a movie, he or she are in a movie, you're like. Oh, uh, it's gonna be a stinker. Hmm, that's a good question. One more attempt. Okay, so action movie star has to be one you hate. Like every single time they're on screen, you're like, "Damn it, not blank again." I know he hasn't been doing a lot of acting recently. Fuck. He's mostly been doing directing. Yeah, Clint Eastwood. No, I, I, I've never been a fan of Clint Eastwood acting, okay. but his directing is pretty good. Yeah. Um. Benedicio del Toro. Yeah? He's going to be in the new Door of the Explorer movie. Yeah, we talked about that. Yeah, I know. It's funny. Yeah. Uh, That That jump is harder than it looks, guys. You have to do a wheelie at the perfect time, and you can't be just mashing B because then he doesn't jump. You know? Oh, Oh, my God. All right, guys. On the next installment of Mega Man Extreme... We're going to try this bike segment for like 15 minutes. I hope I can get past it. I, sure oh, I think so you will be able to. All right. Thank you guys so much so far. I'll see you guys in the next Benicio. <laughs>